All right, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Sable. Uh, I don't remember what episode it is, but welcome back. Well, you'll know. You'll see it in the title. I just, I don't know right now. It's been a fast second since I've played some Sable. I've been playing a lot of Dark Tide. Um, some of that Helldivers 2 that everyone's getting into. But, uh, I guess this is the Geyser Tower. Let me see what's going on here. some flowers. Oh. What if we uh, sneak up? Before I greet them, the hunter is making some breathy noises, loud exhales through near pursed lips and small eff effortful oofs. They run their hand along the back of their skull and stare upwards and away for short moments before turning back in my direction with a shake of their head. It isn't how I'm used to seeing hunters, whom I've come to associate with perfect calm. Glider! I can tell they're trying to infuse some calm into their voice, but it doesn't work. Can you help me? My name's Zebby. I've been out here for a while now. My partner, Dylan. Dylan? Or Dehan? Traveling partner, I should say, got, in, got it in his head to climb up there after some bird's eggs. There's eggs up there? Yes, of course. But you know what else is up there? Dylan! Zebby hops. I'm not happy to admit this, but I'm not too fond of heights. Some would say I'm a little afraid of them. Or a lot. If you could go up there and grab Dylan for me and tell him I'm going to kill him when he gets down here, that would be really helpful. I tell Zebby that I'm happy to do most of that and take on the task. I say goodbye. Okay. Ooh, there's another ring tower. Alright, uh, let's find our way up. Start by climbing this. Just take a moment to catch our breath right here. a beetle twerking up there. That was <laughs> kind of wild looking. It wouldn't be us if we didn't do a little bit of exploring. We are quite high up. Ooh. Is that part of a ship? Sure is. Thing over here? 
inside the ship we go. Weeds outside. Does this also lead outside? It sure does. But oh, neon flash die. Okay. Chumag. Chum. I've come to take you back to your queen. How high up do you think this guy is? Do you think he's all the way up there on that left? He might be. How would I get up there? Explore over here real fast. something underneath this that we're gonna have to check out. Bye birds. Hello there, Glider. What a view, eh? Dylan looks perfectly content, even happy, taking in the scenery alone. I gaze briefly out at the horizon. It is a nice view. We got him with his gecko hat. Quite a nice spot. He nods appreciatively. More than nice, stunning. I tell Dylan that I've been sent by Zebby to encourage him to come back down and continue their journey together from less frightening height. Dylan shakes his head. Zebby, what a killjoy. Here, have a look at this and tell me if you'd come down. Look at that beautiful beast. It's called a pink neck. Ever heard of him? Native to sodic waste. People say they're direct descendants of the creatures that came in on the whale. That one's got a huge clutch of eggs ripe for the taking. Dylan nods his resolve. I just need to figure out how to get them. Can I help you? I ask if there's anything I may be able to help with, given my status. I've been thinking the best ways possible to frighten the mother off with something shiny. And then get the eggs once she's gone. You're collecting masks, right? If you've got anything shiny and metallic, that might do the trick. Tell him I'll think on this and try and be of assistance. He thanks me and returns to his bird watching. I say goodbye to Dylan. Have I got anything shiny? I do want to check out 
is. that climb or if I have to find out oh come on oh come on heck yeah Take a look at this bird, dude. Whoa! Whoop. Hold on. He's huge! Can I get right up next to him? Maybe if I throw this on. Wait, 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 how are you doing, bird? <laughs> I love how he just gently pushes you, he's just like, all right, get down. Afraid of shiny masks. Oh. Maybe we can try this. I don't know if this one's shiny. Is this shiny? No. Okay. So for right now, I don't have a mask to do this. Alright, we'll have to come back to our bird friend another time. Till then, I want to get all the way up there. I want to see truly how high we can go.
real quick. Let's go back to our stuff. Here it comes. Here it comes. Lift off. Too cool, man. Too cool. All right, that's the geyser tower. We're just gonna fall for a second. Uh, F. You ready, Simone? Let's go. We're gonna hit this furthest ring first. And we'll drive through the rest. <laughs> I would never lose Simone. Not possible. Rise, my child. I just want to see what's out here. Could be nothing, could be something. Whoa. What was... What was that sound? Hello, butterfly. You ever be riding, like driving somewhere, and you're like, oh, look at that small thing up ahead. And you get closer to it, and you're like, this thing's massive.
a lot of cacti. And I've been up there, right? This is just the wind tower. One of our first quests. this area maybe we'll spot a cartographer and he'll be able to give us a map Whoop, sandstorm come on some in you can do it these blue things. It's like a gumdrop. Oh. Maybe something lost them? There's a cartographer. Some more out there. Look at the bones out there. What if we bring one of those stones over here? Just lighting. Looks like he's got a stone up there, too. Oh, I appear to have lost it. Oh, what? Wait a minute. Butterflies. Okay. Let's go see uh, if we can get up to that cartographer. I think something like next episode. We'll do like a, a fishing and gathering 
just kind of something calm. Can I get up there? Chalk butterfly. Ooh, I can. I see the path. Let's go to the path. Oh my god, observatory? Another ring? Hold on, we should mark these. That looks like, like a market over there. One sec. We're also gonna mark... This guy... That guy... Oh wait, there's a... There's a guard over there. I don't know if you guys saw that. Hey! Thank you, baby! Can I climb up this, perhaps? Oh, I can't climb this. It's right there. Um. You're joking. How am I supposed to get up there? Okay, I see the chum. There we oh, okay. I just held shift and that worked, I guess. My presence surprises the cartographer, which in turn surprises me. Whoa, where'd you come from? You shouldn't sneak up on people like that. It's not worth explaining. I clearly came from below. What other regions are near? If you're feeling adventurous, head west through the Badlands to the black sands of Akoa. And north, you'll find the Sand Sea. I feel like we've been the Sand Sea. Glider? Can I find this region? They seem thrilled to be discussing this with me. The petrified forest is wonderful. If you venture inside, you might see some giant geodesic stones and knows what fun creatures you might find lurking nearby. Then Marrowbone Station tucks safely beneath the bones of an ancient giant. Okay. 
They say that last bit with some added flair. I appreciate their theatrically. It's, they're enthusiastic. Oh, and if you've ever seen The Watch, well, let me just say there are a few engineering feats quite as... There are few engineering feats quite as resident. And finally, a word I can't pronounce, but it's the Great Worm. Most people tell you it's some ancient monument. Sort of tribute to something. I think I... I think it may have been alive once. The lighter. Can I buy a map? Here's what I have. Do you have... I'll take the badge. Take the map. I feel like I have enough badges. Yeah, four cartographer badges. Okay. Keep up buying them. But we can go make two masks when we feel the need. First, let's get that Chumig, get whatever lies in remnants of this ship. Climb? No climb, okay. Nope. I don't know if you see what I see, but on the pillar on our right, I'm going to put it just kind of like very to the right. There's a chumag down there. So right above, right between my horns, there's a chumag. We also want the one that's below here. He's over there. Do I have enough height here to get him? Oh, well, sure as I'll try. Head towards uh, some of these markings we got. We got a lot of markings everywhere. So we'll just go towards the blue one first.
Well, all right, ladies and gentlemen, if you have enjoyed today's episode, whatever episode number it may be, uh, drop a like, possibly subscribe if you're new, comment down below if you liked what you saw, and on the next episode, uh, we're going to go inside whatever this thing is. Looks cool. Is there a person we can talk to? Maybe not. Alright. Bye.